What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Um, welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel, Caps, and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. This is the free general oracle card reading for sign of Capricorn. This can resonate if you have Capricorn in any aspects of your charts. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North Node, Behavior, Teacher, Charts. Stuff charge. so with the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it fly. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate and leave the rest. Free general oracle card reading for Sonic Hacks. Love and appreciate each and every one of you guys. We're at 12,325 subscribers right now, I think. So thanks so much, everybody, for the love and support to the channel. I love and appreciate each and every one of you guys. It helps support a single mama and two kids income stream. So thanks so much for all the love and support to the channel. I truly appreciate it. I received one channel message as I was meditating on your May of 2022's energy. And the um, message I received was backing off is what I heard, backing off. So energies can be reversed. So this could be you backing off a person, people, place, family, or situation, or someone you're connected to backing off a person, people, place, family, or situation. However, that resonates in one's life, Capricorn. Only you know your story, not anybody else. So you have to plug in your own life, how it resonates. However, do not force the messages that they do not resonate in your life. I just want to disclaimer that. Okay. Wishbone, wish will not be granted. Dark woman, dealings a relationship with a woman with dark complexion or hair. Spare messages you have for Sonic Capricorn. Um, I also encourage everyone to check out their Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Ortho, Men, Hemen, or Jupiter chart signs if, um, if you are interested in that. And also, you're welcome to cross-watch any of the other Zodiac signs or any other readings um, if you would like. Spirit messages you have to sign up for. Grasshopper, situation in the balance that requires careful handling. A Scorpio is about to try to cause complete chaos in your life. Know this. Transmute the energy. You once helped this person. Oh, my Lord. Yikes. So you plug it in how it resonates. Oh, my Lord. So you plug it in how it resonates. I heard a Scorpio is about to try to cause complete chaos in your life soon, Capricorn. Um, I heard um, transmute the energy. It'd be very... Um, um, you once helped this person. So you plug it in how it resonates. Some kind of scorpionic energy. Uh, I feel they could be masculine or feminine energy. You have to plug this person in in your own life how it resonates. If they do resonate for you. Um, you once helped this person. You once helped this scorpionic energy. Whoever they are and how they apply. Help them in some shape, form, or fashion. Uh, but I heard they're about to try to cause complete chaos in your life. Um, so I think they think it's going to benefit them in some shape, form, or fashion to cause complete chaos in your life. Um, but I heard it be um, to transmute the energy. Of course, you can listen to the spiritual downloads or not. But um, how that applies in one's life um, for whatever Capricorn this resonates for. Spirit messages you have for Capricorn. Scorpio, for some it is a Libra. For some it is a Leo. For some it is Scorpio. For some it is a Leo. For some it is a Libra. So I feel it could be a masculine or feminine Scorpio, Libra, or Leo. They could have Scorpio, Libra, or Leo in their sun, moon, rising, Venus, or some in here to Jupiter charge. You have to plug this person in your own life, how they resonate. They, I feel they can be masculine or feminine. I didn't hear masculine or feminine. Scorpio, uh, Libra, or Leo. But somebody's about to try to cause complete chaos in your life. But I heard you once helped this person. So whoever they are and how they apply. Number 36, 
60, 34, or 43 could be very significant numbers in one's life. Number 36, 60, 34, or 43, it could be a possible age of you or somebody you're connected to, possible lottery number, possible date of birth number, possible green card number, possible jersey number. 36, 60, 34, 43. We have koi fish spirit, swan spirit. There is always enough time for a deep dive. Broken wishbone, wish will not be granted. Dark woman, dealing with a relationship with a woman with dark complexion or hair. Grasshopper, situation in the balance that requires careful handling. Success, uncertainty. Um, you could be dealing with a water sign or an air sign. Um, I heard scorpionic and Libra energy with the Leo energy. So um, for some, you definitely are dealing with a water sign and an um, air sign. They have Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, or Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, and their Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, or Thumb, and Hater, Jupiter charts. If that resonates for you, caps. Koi Fish Spirit, there is always enough. There is a pl plenty of abundance out in the universe. You have to go get it. But for some, you have to do it the right way. For some, you have always done it the right way. Okay, so you plug it in how it resonates. I heard there's plenty of abundance out in the universe, but you have to go get it. Uh, for some, uh, you have to do it the right way. For some, you have always done it the right way. So you plug it in how it resonates, however you apply into the situation. Um, for some of you guys, I feel you don't have enough money. I feel it's financial abundance here. Um, I think we're talking about money. I feel you feel you don't have enough money. Uh, for some, I heard you have always done it the right way. So you've always done it the right way as far as going out and getting your money. Uh, for some, you have not. So I feel criminal behavior there, either currently or in the past. But um, I heard for the ones that have participated in criminal behavior, either now or in the past, um, you need to do it the right way. So however that resonates in one's life. Um, but we're talking about fiscal money here and abundance is what I'm feeling. Uh, I think you feel you don't have enough money. There is always enough. Swan spirit, time for a deep dive. Several shocking series of chain events are about to occur in a Capricorn's life. It's about to really give you a huge wake-up call and make you reflect on the past in a huge way. Okay, I heard several shocking series of shame events are about to occur in a cap's life. It's about to make you have a huge wake-up call, sit back and reflect on the past in a huge way. So something shocking is about to happen in your life in some shape, form, or fashion. I feel that could go positively or negatively. Let me see if I hear anything else. But time for a deep dive, I think, is you sitting back and reflecting on the past, whether it's positive shocking series of shame events or negative ones. Someone connected to you is about to get a job offer soon. It's about to shock you. Someone connected to you, you're about to realize, is impregnated by someone that has many, 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 many children out in the universe. It's about to embarrass the hell out of you. Oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. It might be that masculine energy I've been picking up in almost all these readings. Um, yikes. You plug it in how it resonates. So, um, you plug it in how it resonates. So, Someone connected to you is about to get a job offer soon. Um, I heard it's about to shock you, so I guess you didn't think this person was. Um, either they're looking for a job or someone's going to come to them and offer them a job. However that resonates, but why it's going to shock you that they're going to get this job offer, I'm not sure. It might be about who's offering it to them, possibly, um, or the situation or what have you. I mean, everybody's life situation is different, so you have to plug it in how it resonates, but somehow it's going to shock you if that resonates for you. It's somebody connected to you. It's not you. So whoever this is for. Um, and someone connected to you is, um, you're about to find out they're pregnant is what it sounds like, but they're pregnant by someone, a masculine energy, obviously, because he has penis part to impregnate. 
impregnated by a masculine energy, but this masculine energy has many children all over the universe. And I think it's that same masculine energy I've been picking up in these readings. Um, that's about to be exposed very publicly. It may or may not be. You plug it in how it resonates, but that might make you sit back and reflect on the past as well. The time for a deep dive as far as reflecting energy. Is somebody connected to you? I think you care about them, is what I'm saying. I think you care about them. But pregnancies are normally very happy in a stable, healthy, copacetic relationship. But this person, whoever, this person that you care about connected to you, that's about, you're about to find out they're pregnant by this masculine energy. He obviously doesn't care about people. He does not care about people or situations. He cares about, he obviously has severe sexual addictions, whoever he is. And I'm serious about that, severe sexual addictions. Um, and if it's the same masculine energy I've been picking up in all the readings, he hasn't been telling all the women about the other women, but they're all finding out about each other. Um, I mean, they're going to file for child support and people going in for court cases. I mean, all kinds of crazy stuff. So. If it's the same masculine energy, but however that resonates, whoever this person is that you care about that's connected to you, you're about to find out they're pregnant by this person, he has a ton of different other people pregnant or currently have kids out in the universe or a mixture of both. So you plug it in how it resonates. A public pool is about to become significant to a Capricorn. A private pool is about to become significant to a, Cap a Capricorn. Okay, I heard a public pool is about to become significant to a Capricorn and a private pool. So time for a deep dive in that aspect is the pool energy. For some, it's a public pool. For some, it's a private pool. It could be your pool that's private or someone you're connected to. Maybe you have a friend that has a pool and you will go over and you swim there. Or um, someone you're connected to has a pool or you have a private pool or you go to a public pool. How that resonates. Broken wishbone, wish will not be granted. A breakup is about to become very significant in a Capricorn's life. And a Capricorn is about to contact the police on information of stolen money. Well, that's a good one, Capricorn. Um, that's a good one. So if that resonates for you, um, well, not the breakup part, not the breakup part, sorry. Uh, a breakup is about to become significant in your life. So to me, that could be you getting broke up with or you breaking up with somebody. Um, to me, that can go positively or negatively or somebody you're connected to breaking up with somebody. It doesn't necessarily have to be you. Somebody's about to get broke up with, though, whether you're the one getting broke up with or um, someone breaking up with you or somebody you're connected to breaking up with somebody. How that resonates. Um, but the other one's good. I heard one of you guys is about to go to the police soon with information on stolen money. So wish will not be granted in that aspect is the person that stole money. Their ass is about to be exposed, but you're about to help expose them. Whoever you are and how that applies. So you're about to make their wish not be granted because they're a thief. Um, whoever you are and how that applies. And that's a freaking lootly, man, because imagine if the roles were reversed and their ass was stole from, they wouldn't appreciate that. And that's just the truth. Nobody appreciates being stole from, used, abused, exploited, etc., etc. I'm sure including this person, but they have the audacity to do it to somebody else. But you're about to be a hero in this, whoever you are. So congrats to whoever that's for, Capricorn. So this is really not too bad. I mean, wish will not be granted is the breakup energy and the you going to the police and exposing somebody about some stolen money. Um, how that resonates. For some, you could be exposing a dark woman. Uh, maybe they stole money, possibly. I didn't hear a sign or who it was, but who, you only you know you're showing out anybody else. So whoever you know has stolen money from person, people, place, family, situation, however that applies in your life. But for some, I feel it could be a dark woman because it was connected to this. Um, a woman with dark complexion or hair, possibly. Only you know your story, not anybody else. Dealings or relationship with a woman with dark complexion or hair.
For one of these women, they are a thief, and you know this, and you're about to expose them. For one of these women, they are a part of your life. You thought they were extremely egotistical, but you're realizing they most certainly are not. A very hard worker. Okay, so you plug it in how it resonates. So there's two aspects of this, this person. There's two women, actually, in this card, if this resonates for you, if this resonates for you. One may resonate in your life. Two plus may resonate. I mean, one may resonate. Both may resonate. None may resonate. Only you know your story, not anybody else. But one of these women is the thief, I heard. So one is the thief. And for some of you guys, she's the thief. But in one of you guys' situation, but for some of you guys, the thief may be somebody else. So for one of you guys, this person definitely is the thief. And I, I think you know she's the thief. For one of you guys, she may not be, and it may be somebody else. So one, she definitely is the thief. Oh, however that applies. She, um, she could have dark complexion or hair. So dark complexion meaning darker skin. Um, like a red bone energy or dark dark or very tan or um or um something of that nature maybe ethnic or um or not or she could have dark hair like me like um dark brown or black hair or dark 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 hair how that resonates and be light complexion how that resonates but one of these uh women she is a thief for one, I heard she's currently is in your energetic space in your life, and you thought she was very egotistical in the past, but you are realizing that she's not. She's actually a very, very, very hard worker. So only you know your story, not anybody else. So you have to plug this person um, and these two situations in your life, however they resonate, if they resonate for you. For one, you were trying to manifest this feminine energy, the hard worker in for love, but you have realized that it's severely backfired. And you're right, it has because of the past. Okay, so you plug it in how it resonates. So for one of you guys, you were trying to manifest situation two, the hard worker feminine energy um, that you thought was egotistical in the past, but you're realizing she's not. Um, you were trying to manifest her in for love. Um I don't know if it was love bombing or true love. Only you know your story to anybody else. But um, but I heard you've realized it's backfired and it has because of the past. So she has been a part of your past in some shape, form, or fashion. Um, but it sounds like she doesn't want to go back there. <laughs> However, that resonates, um, if that applies for you. Grasshopper situation and the balance that requires careful handling. A Capricorn is about to help expose a meth lab. Very careful, though, because people very uh, close to you, some in your family, about to contact a, pri um, a police investigator soon, very privately. Holy crap. Wow, Capricorn. That's a great one. But I don't blame you. I would be doing the same exact thing. I'd be going very privately in the confines of my space. In a private phone call and doing this too. Um, I heard for some it's in your family. Um, so if this resonates for you, you're about to expose meth lab, I heard. For some, this feminine energy could be her, um, the number one person, not number two, the hard worker, um, not egotistical person, number one person, thiefer. She could be part of the meth lab, possibly for some of you guys. For some, maybe not. Um, but it's somebody in your family, uh, so Either one or two plus people in your family is connected to this meth lab. Uh, for some, it could, your whole family could be running the meth lab. I mean, I don't know. Only you know your story to anybody else. But at least one person in your family, if this resonates for you, is connected to running this meth lab. Um, and you know this. Um, so you are going to go very, very privately, I heard. Very privately. Very confidentiality type S energy. Um, 
I'm thinking you might go in a private room or you might go in a vehicle or you might walk down the street in a secluded area and contact the police. I heard you're going to go in a very private area and contact the police. I think it's because one of these people is in your family or two plus of them possibly maybe in your family. And for some, it may be this person in situation one. Um, wow. But I heard you're about to expose information on this meth lab. So situation in the balance that requires careful handling. I think it's because you have members of your family connected to this meth lab. But it sounds like um, you want this meth lab busted. And absolutely, man, I don't blame you. Um, I don't care if they're in my family or not. Um, they should be run no meth lab. I mean, that's why I don't speak to any members of my toxic family, period, um, because I don't want to know about any criminal behavior or behaviors if there is any of that going on. And that's just the truth. Um, I'm not saying there is because I haven't spoke to my family in a long time, but I understand that is what I'm saying, if that resonates for you. So in this situation, it's you handling this with a, a police investigator in a very private confidential way because you don't i think you don't want your family to come after you because they know you're about to expose them uh, expose the meth lab and some of them are involved with it that's exactly what i think for another capricorn this is work related they realize they really meddled in too, too deeply with one particular person, but things are about to balance out from series of chain of events. For one Capricorn, you're about to turn it around on a water sign energy in a huge way. Scorpionic energy. Okay, so you plug in and how it resonates. So one of these, one is a meth live energy, one it is work situation energy. If this resonates with you uh, with the work situation energy i heard you realize you meddled too deeply in one particular it sounds like a co-worker or someone or you could be a boss maybe for some or a manager boss supervisor or ceo or just a co-worker of this person but somehow they're in your workspace and i heard you realize you meddled too deeply in um in their um in them with them in some shape form or fashion um but um i heard everything is going to balance out but, um, and you're going to turn it around on a particular scorpionic energy, water sign energy, and then a heard scorpionic. So um, you plug this in, however that resonates, that could be the situation in the balance that requires careful handling too. You handling this workspace situation in a very careful manner. Um, for some, it could be that situation number two, fem energy possibly, um, that is very hard worker and you thought she was very egotistical in the past, but you're realizing she's not possibly. Or not, however that resonates. Um, however that applies in one's life, Capricorn. But I think you want to make this right now um, because you're realizing things that you didn't realize in the past is what I'm feeling here. That's exactly what I'm feeling. Um, but I heard it's all going to balance out. It's going to balance out, but I think it's about, it's going to balance out because of the way you're about to handle it. Um, I think you're about to, I think the back off energy might be on that person, uh, possibly, because we are back off, backing off at the beginning. It might be on that person and then you going and turning, transmuting the energy on the Scorpion energy. It doesn't sound like the Scorpion energy is positive energy um, for you. And I'm serious. Um, however, that resonates. However, that resonates. Only you know your story, not anybody else. So how you handle this is how you handle it. Okay. Holy moly. Success. Successful outcome to a problem coming soon. About to do the right thing. Oh, okay. Well, I mean, this isn't overall, it's not too bad, Caps. I mean, it. Um, Scorpios was pretty rocky, but this one is not too, too bad. Um, I heard successful outcome to a problem coming soon is all in how you're about to handle it. So um, some kind of successful outcome to a problem in some shape, form, or fashion, but it's all in how you're about to handle it. So I feel for some, you could be a position of leadership in some shape, form, or fashion, or um, or position a leadership in your family. To me, it could be personal or professional, but 
some, some kind of successful outcome to a problem, whether it's personal or professional, or maybe both for some, but it's all in how you're about to handle it. So success in this situation, uh, but it's all in about your how. How about your, I can't speak. It's all in about how you're about to handle this situation to create the successful outcome, um, if that makes sense. Uncert uncertainty. Bed rest coming for one Capricorn, bed rest coming for someone connected to a Capricorn. Oh, Lord. Oh, geez. So you plug it in how it resonates. I heard bed rest coming for one Capricorn and bed rest coming for someone connected to a Capricorn. So bed rest energy is the uncertainty. Um, maybe you or whoever is connected to you that's about to be put on bed rest. If this message applies for you, maybe you don't know when you'll be able to come off a of bed rest. Um, however, that resonates. Um, now, bed rest can come for many different situations. Um, pregnancy, neuro issues, uh, falls, etc., etc., etc. So whatever occur, um, either already has occurred or is about to occur to cause the bed rest, either in you or somebody you're connected to. However, that resonates. But I think this is uncertainty of um, when you or whoever this is connected to you will be able to get off bed rest, if that resonates. A federal agent is about to communicate with the Capricorn soon. It's about to shock the hell out of them. It'd be very smart to be honest, very honest. Oh, my Lord. Whoa. I heard a federal agent is about to communicate with a Capricorn soon. It'd be very smart to be honest with this federal agent. Very honest. So in this aspect, uncertainty is um, you being shocked. You wasn't uncertainty. You was not expecting this federal agent to contact you. Um, I heard spiritual download to be very smart to be very honest with them, though. Very honest. So um, maybe you were Maybe when they contact you, you will be very, you will be uncertain as to whether to be honest with them. But I heard be very smart to be honest with them. And for anybody who doesn't know, lying to a federal agent is a federal offense. For anybody who doesn't know, just a little FYI, lying to a federal agent that's like perjuring oneself. It's a federal offense. So if you're uncertain, if you should be honest with a federal agent, spiritual download was to be honest. It'd be very smart to be honest. But I'm telling you the truth. It is. Federal offenses, you can get put in federal prison for lying to a federal agent and they expose your ass. I'm just being pro for all. If anybody doesn't know that, I'm serious. So I think uncertainty in this aspect is um, whether you should tell the truth to a federal agent, but of course you have free will and you can lie if you want. But I wouldn't do, I wouldn't lie, and that's just the damn truth. So you plug it in how it resonates. A particular Libra in energy is about to be very, very upset at you because you're about to reveal some very important information that's about to expose them. But you need to do what's best for you. Know this. For some, it's a Libra masculine. For some, it's a Libra feminine. Okay, so you plug it in how it resonates. So a particular Libra in energy is going to be uh, about to be very pissed at you if this resonates for you, Capricorn, because I heard you're about to reveal some very important information. Sounds like on them or a situation um, that they did not want you to reveal because it basically it it sounds like it implicates them in some shape form, sh some shape form or fashion. But I heard it uh, it's what's best for you. So um, I feel like cover your ass energy is what I feel here. I feel cover your ass energy. Um, that's exactly what I feel. For some of you guys, I heard it's a Libra fem. For some, it's a Libra masculine. So you have to plug yourself in wherever you resonate. If you do resonate. Whether it's a Libra masculine or a Libra femme, they could have Libra in their sun, moon, rising, Venus, North Node, Midheaven, and Jupiter charts. If that resonates for you, Capricorn. All right, I hope this helped. I love you guys so much. And everybody make wonderful choices. And namaste.